wearing my cold weather uniform. Very typical. Miss Hads, you got a big day ahead of you. Are you ready for a fun day? Are you ready to do something really fun today? Hey, look at me. Do you want to go get some coffee and then drive up to Flagstaff and go to the snow? <gasps> Are you ready to go to the snow? You're so sweet. <laughs> look bold. Good morning. We are heading up to Flagstaff as like a spur of the moment, random like little trip. Well, we, we thought we might do it this week, but we woke up Saturday morning and we're gonna do it. So Hadley's never been to the snow, ever. She's almost five years old and she's never been to the snow and Austin and I are both from the snow. So we are super excited to take her up there. We're just gonna go on like a random like little walking trail, maybe hit up I don't know, like a little coffee shop or something like that. We're just gonna do a really quick trip up, trip up to Flagstaff, but I'm excited. They, they apparently got a lot of snow the last few weeks. It was kind of warm there yesterday, so we're like, maybe gonna get, we might see it, I don't know. We're gonna check like the webcams around the town when we get close just to make sure. But I'm really excited to take her up there. I think she's gonna love it. I've been thinking about this for like years. I'm like, why have we never had her in the snow? So. We're gonna go take her. Hats. Hadley, are you excited to see the snow? Should we go? Should we go get in the car? Let's go. Come on. Let's go get in the car. Go get Dad. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. That's better. See ya. <laughs> go. Go get him. He's always sick of waiting for us. <laughs> I think we're gonna go with Uggs to start. <sighs> and I might actually just bring these to walk in. They're not walking shoes, but there's something. We're always waiting for your mother, Hadley. Banana. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of shoes do you bring for walking? I just brought my vans. Okay, I am. I think I'm just gonna wear those Converse. Okay, do we need anything else? No. Okay. Let's do it. Hats! Are you excited? Yeah. <laughs> This banana literally looks like a giraffe. It does not look like a full on giraffe. <laughs> like if I were to do an art project in school, that's what it would look like. <laughs> Listen, you gotta back off the banana. I'm just trying to say that I'm gonna eat it before it goes bad. <laughs> and I just don't want to waste food, you know? <laughs> so I'm gonna eat the whole banana. It's not moldy, it's just ripe. We haven't been here in a long time. I feel like it's our travel stop, you know? Yeah, this is part of our travel activity. Yeah. You drink logo coffee? <laughs> I get cold I think you only get cold at Starbucks. Uh, can I get a grande vanilla sweet cream cold brew? I'll do a grande brown sugar oat milk shake and espresso. <laughs> grande what? <laughs> the brown sugar oat milk shake and espresso. Oh, okay. And then, uh, <laughs> then a grande brown sugar oat milk shake and espresso. Half sweet. You got it. And then can I get that half sweet, please? Half sweet? Yeah. 
And then I'll do egg white okay, roasted. Anything else for you? I'll do the egg white oh, roasted egg bites. Uh, and then the egg white roasted pepper egg bites. <laughs> Okay. And then, you guys don't have the slow roasted ham in Swiss anymore, do you? Okay. Can I do the, um, I'll do the double smoked bacon uh, sandwich. Yeah, absolutely. And that should do it. Sounds great. I'll see you at the window for twenty two ninety one. Thank you. Thank you. I couldn't stop laughing because I was giving you the literally longest things on the menu to say. <laughs> <laughs> and it just bamboozled you, like you didn't know what to say every single time. <laughs> You're welcome. Have you seen the guy that just has his wife recorded, and then when he gets up to the drive-thru, he just plays the recording? Yeah, I feel like that's what I have to do. <laughs> and I feel like I try, like I, I will in Starbucks lines, like say it across to you, but sometimes they're all, I mean usually they're like, I can't hear you. So, do they want to deal with that? It's disgusting. It's a banana, folks. I just like the reason why I don't eat bananas. I don't like the way it makes my mouth feel. Oh. And I also can't stand listening to you chew bananas and we're stuck in this car together. So, riddle me this. Mm -hmm. You don't like the way that the banana feels. This conversation is going sideways real quick. Um, We're up to the window. But you can slurp oysters? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that does not up. I think we have a Starbucks app. There you go. Perfect. Thank you very much. Would you like a recipe? And then that food will be right out here. Thank you. Had to move a lot of shit around. Oh, yeah. What, where, where was the conversation going? Or, I was just saying you don't like you're talking about you don't like the, the texture of, of a banana, but you will eat oysters and mushrooms. Oh, that's right, that's right. Which that's what I don't get. Yeah, I don't know. I can't. I don't have an explanation on that. I think it's like that. Like the banana, like coats my mouth with like a like potassium. Like it like coats it. Coats your mouth with potassium. <laughs> They really shook the hell out of it. There's like ice chunks in here. That's good. It's actually not bad. I haven't had Starbucks since I think it's the London airport. And that wasn't that great. Well, the that could be like a different country, you know? The reason that Starbucks is never bad is it's just, it's very simple. It is, but sometimes it's like too sweet. Well, that's what I was going to say. It's just got a bunch of sugar in it. Yeah, which I just like don't like too sweet, but my brown sugar shake is best it always tastes good. It's always safe because it's gonna taste good. Because That's because you always get the safe ones. Like you always get like the safe like cold brew with sweet cream. Yeah. Like I know what I'm signing up for. I'm signing up for like 60 grams of sugar, but I'm fine with it. That's so true. There's not for you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. Ah! Ooh, baby. I wish I would make these egg white bites at home. Probably could. How's the Sammy? You just gotta go on to TikTok and they'll learn ya. That's true. How's the Sammy? It's good. I'm just still really pissed that they got rid of the um Sorry I'm driving. Uh um <laughs> It look it looks phenomenal. Slow roasted ham and Swiss though is the goat and I'm just kinda sad they got rid of them. Hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side, our fears are done. All the good times just begun. Oh, we know what we have, let's hold on tight. Found what we're looking for in life. Call All right, we made to Flagstaff, and there is so much snow. Like, actually so much snow Austin's going to the bathroom right now we're like refilling up on gas and then we are gonna head to like this little area in the middle of nowhere that kind of has like a view of the mountain in Flagstaff and we're just gonna kind of like walk around run around and like let Hadley play I am so excited you guys like 
the fact that Hadley is five years old and she's never seen snow just like makes me so sad and I've also like why don't we come here more often like it's beautiful and it's not that hard of a drive so I think we need to make a point to coming up here a little more often and just like grabbing an Airbnb for the weekend or even like during the week when like we work from home we can come up here whenever so yeah I don't know I'm gonna try to convince Austin that we need to come up here more often because I love it the only issue is I'm the passenger princess and he has to drive so I feel bad for him but it works out well for me so Hadley's super excited like she wants to go outside so bad but I don't want to let her out like at this dirty gas station I want to like let her out when she sees snow for the first time to make an open field and I want to video it so we just can't do it here so we're gonna wait we're gonna grab a water for her get some gas go to the bathroom and then we're gonna head out I wish you knew my excitement I'm like a snow gal through and through Seeing the mountain makes me want to go snowboarding, but it's okay. We will do that a different time. We just can't do it today. But, Hads, are you so excited? Yeah. She has no idea. She's going to freaking love it. I'm just so, so happy for her. My little heart. Okay. Like I said, there's so much snow. I mean, this is like a dirty gas station, so bear with me. But look at how much snow that is. Like, come on. Oh, we're gonna have a day. Hads, do you know where you are? You're about to have the time of your life. Yeah. There's so much snow. Should we go see the snow? <gasps> yeah. Okay, Mama's got to put on some different shoes because yeah. these Uggs are not going to work. These Uggs are going to have to come off. And the only other shoes I brought are literally Converse because I'm an idiot. I should have brought my Sorrels. Like, I have, like, legit Sorrel boots. That was a mistake. It was a mistake, but we're going to make it work. So we got to this little part. It's, like, a little bit outside of Flagstaff, and there's a bunch of people here. But I think we're going to go walk around and see, like, if we can find some trails around the area. And we're first gonna keep Hadley on leash. It was a request by Austin. And then we're gonna let her run loose if we can find a like area that the letter. I'm just worried my feet are gonna be soaked. Got him on. And I didn't bring a spare like socks. How dumb am I? It's like I didn't grow up in the snow or something. We are gonna get out. I'm so excited. Coming to get you, baby. Let's do it. Didn't bring long socks. I know. I wish I'd have brought like a spare change of socks. I feel like that was kind of stupid. Oh well. I might just be going back barefoot with uh, my Birkenstocks. <laughs> oh, he did bring Birkenstocks. That's a good idea. Yeah, I'll probably be barefoot in my Uggs. Alrighty. Do you want the leash and the collar? Yep. Just want her collar, collar. Yep. Hadley, what is that? It's perfect for a fresh haircut. It's called snow. She's just sniffing. She's like, where are we? Uh, you got locked the car? Yeah. <laughs> I'm so happy for her. Look at her. She's like all proud. <laughs> you guys are sprinting. Are we just gonna find a trail and start hiking on it? Let's go this way, Hadley. Hadley, what is this stuff? <laughs> what is it? Hadley. <laughs> she doesn't know what to do. Let's go this way. Come on. I think she's a little scared. Wow. Wow. You go pop. <laughs> just know what to do. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> yeah. Go, go, go! 
There, chum. Uh, like I said, it's a little cold when the wind's blowing, but I know. Well, not, not bad. But like, look how pretty this is. There's no one out here. I know, it's just us. Look at Hadley. Here comes Hadley. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> I think it was worth the drive. Hads, how was your first day on the snow? Can you tell mama how it went? She's got some snowballs on her. <laughs> we made down to downtown flag. We were just at, it's called Kendrick Park and it's a little bit outside of Flagstaff. It's actually like right below where like the actual like ski mountain is. And so you get like a really good view of like the mountain and everything, it was really cool. And like there was a bunch of people there trying to sled, but it wasn't like, like you could like go out and like find your own space, which is really nice. That was really cool. I thought that that was like a good spot to go. Hadley loved it, but I think we're, she's gonna be a little stiff. Either she's gonna be stiff or we have a broke or a torn ACL. Stop. No, she's fine. <laughs> I know, I'm nervous. Um, but we're gonna go walk around downtown Flag, which I don't think I've ever actually walked around downtown Flag stuff. Maybe. And then we're gonna try to find, you haven't either, right? No. Then we're gonna try to find a place to eat, maybe something outside since we have Hadley. And then we're gonna call it a day. That's all, it's 40 degrees, so it's gonna be nice out. I might actually keep my hat on. So I don't look too out of place and my hair is greasy. All right, let's go do it. Yay! <laughs> Literally a snowbank. <laughs> You gonna be able to get out? Yep. Okay, good. Do you have the keys? Yeah, I have the keys. <laughs> Holy shit, you could kill someone with those things. Crazy! We're in a predicament because there's like no patios open. I honestly think it's because there was so much snow that they had to like clear them out. But who knows? Online said so that they could sit out, you could sit outside in the winter. But I think we're gonna go pick up some pizza. Honestly, I could go for like a latte too. I'm kind of in the middle. Good news is, Hadley can walk. Come on! <laughs> and we don't have a torn ACL. That's all that matters. My nose is really red. Yo. <laughs> I can tell I'm cold. All right, we're gonna go try out a place called Pizza Cletta. It's one of like the more popular spots in Flagstaff. We got a hardcore recommendation. Yeah, this is supposed to be not only best pizza in Flagstaff, but top tier pizza in Arizona. Ooh, I'm going in for the gluten on this one. I'm, I'm gonna have to try it out. And they have outdoor seating, so it'll be super nice. All right, let's go over there. Oh, you just slid. Come on. <laughs>
Hello. <laughs> Hey, sweetie. She just looks pissed. <laughs> Can I get a pizza review? This is the closest you can get to a perfect score. Wow. This is amazing. That oh is, my God. That is something. I've eaten a lot of pizzas in my day, folks. <laughs> this is so fucking good. <laughs> the hype. It looks good. It's everything so fresh. The sauce is fresh. Yeah, the fresh. sauce tastes really the fresh. The cheese is fresh. Mm -hmm. Wow. Just phenomenal. This is one of the best pizzas. I've never had it. Before. It's really good. Mine is like prosciutto or rhubarb. And there's something else in there that tastes so good. I could use like a little bit of honey. I know one of them had them. Do you think I could so ask? So the other one had honey. But it didn't have prosciutto on it, right? Uh uh. You must ask me some honey. So good. <laughs> Alrighty. That closes out. The Flagstaff vlog. What time is it? How long have we been here for? I think we did like four hours in Flagstaff. Yeah, it's almost two o'clock. We, I don't even know, I, I, again, I don't even know what time we got in at. I think like 10. So yeah, it would take like four hours. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, we're gonna head back down to Phoenix. Quick little trip. Just gonna close it out. Look at baby. I'm happy we did it. It was so fun. I know, how they loved it. I know, and she does not have a torn ACL. That's like, that's good. Not yeah, yet. you keep think you keep trying to like tell everybody that uh, everybody's gonna think she's hurt, and she's not. She's, well, she's not hurt. I just thought she was because she couldn't like walk when she was like getting to the car after she's in the snow. Um, alrighty. Peace. Thanks for being here. Later. Later. Later, skater. <laughs>